Oh! Are you kidding? Are you kidding? <laughs> Got him now. Alright, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. We are at Okaloosa Island Pier this morning, hanging out with Beach Bum. And we just realized we're we're a twinsies this morning. We're we're wearing the exact same Waterland shirt. It's already lame enough walking on a pier. <laughs> we're wearing cats. GoPros. And, and now we match. <laughs> like, how lame can we be? Luckily, it's not too busy out there, so uh, <laughs> we're not gonna get too many weird looks. That, we're gonna I am rocking a beach foam hat. You should, if you were wearing the bearded Brad hat, it would have been perfect. Oh my god, do you have the beach foam? I hat? do. Oh, dude, that would have been freaking hilarious. Like, we would. <laughs> I feel like I'm about to walk into school <laughs> and just totally get ripped, dude. We're like a little fishing team here. <laughs> but we got a storm coming up and we got some strong south winds and that should get some fish fired up up on the pier. I still have never landed a king from the pier, so that is my one objective. I've hooked a few. I've got one right to the pier waiting on a gaff and pulled the hook on it as close as I've been. So today we're gonna try to make it happen. There's also been a few other opportunities out here lately. So we're rigged up for anything and everything this morning, but we're gonna get loaded up, head on out there. I'll catch y'all when we get out there fishing. All right guys, we're gonna start out throwing the X-Wrap long cast here this morning. Check or drag. See if we got any kings, some Spanish. Already seen a few Spanish come over the rail. We got wind blowing right in our face, so hopefully y'all can hear me all right. Oh, there we go. Something little. Maybe a little Spaniard. Or oh, is that? It might be a hard tail. It's definitely something small. <laughs> On the X-Rap. Nice. First hard tail of the year. <laughs> a to lure just about as big as him. All right. Not the target species. Like, what was that guy thinking eating an X wrap? <laughs> it's a hungry little dude. So, if we do happen to catch some Spanish, do you want to keep them? Yes. So, that's a thought, thought process. First fish for the day for me. Nice Spanish. I think my GoPro froze, so I don't know that I got the fight on there, but uh, we're going to bleed them out, get them on ice, see if we can hit us some more. Oh, oh gosh. Did you see that? Oh, there he goes. There he goes. Come on. I'm sure that dolphin's coming around. He's a foul hook, too, I think. There we go. He came for it twice. Shoo. All day X wrap. Second Spanish. We might, we might be able to feed the people today, Brad. Getting lunch nice spanish here solid we got a couple in the cooler now brad got his first one this is thick man that looks pretty good might take it to the shop and feed some people if we can get enough fish we'll get this guy blood out pop his gills see if we can get some more here fishy fishy we got some peoples to feed nice spanish oh you got some chasers Bunch. Says they'll come eat me. Oh, oh come off. Oh, 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 oh. I screwed the pooch on that one. They're on me. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. They're on me too. Oh, he came up for it, missed it. Come on. About to throw a little pump jig down there and whack him. Oh, he's after it. He's after it. Come on. They got commitment issues. Take a Spanish and what? Put it in a pond. Yeah. <laughs> That'd be pretty sweet. Yeah. Why not? Right, I'm going to switch over to this little jig here. See if this will get the Spanish fired up. They're having some commitment issues here. Tied playing around with them. Yeah. 
As big as these Spanish are, they'll probably cut me off though. What is that? 50. There you go. Oh, got him. Ah, ripped it out of his Did mouth. No. Uh oh. Uh oh. Hang on. I'll get my line in your tip, rod tip. Cut mine if you got something on you. Yep. There he is. There we go. They like that little jig. See if we can get him away from the dolphin. Hardtail. Little light tackle. Ah, it is a hardtail. All right, he fell off good. Didn't need him. Oh, that's a Spanish. That was a Spanish. Get your butt up here. Load up on them. Yeah. Getting us a little fish fry for lunch. Don't even think about it, Fred. Fred, 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 Fred. I mean, is there a better lure? Oh, did you hook up? Than a white X trap? I mean, come on now. That's right. Redfish, jacks. I mean, just if it swims, it eats it. Whiting. Crush them, man. That's not a hard tell. Get him, Brad. Oh, that dolphin's going to be on him before you know it. But better not let them whoop you. Don't let them whoop. Oh, you better you better follow them. Let me go underneath you real quick. Might be a big Spanish here. He's worried about that dolphin. Ugh. Nice. It's a fatty on some light tackle there. Working on getting us a good mess of Spanish here. Another one going in the box. Not a whole lot left of this jig here. We'll see if we can get us another one on it before we switch up. A couple more, we'll have enough for a nice fish fry. Yeah, I think we're good, man. Now we just need that king and that cobia. Uh, yeah. That school of jacks. Oh, no, it ain't. Oh, look at, look at Check me. They didn't hit it very hard. They're loving this little jig. There's a fish. That might be a Spanish. Fish, better fish. Better fish. Come on, Mr. Spanish. You're the same school I did three. <laughs> it could be a hard tell because I caught him down low. Uh, yeah. He just felt big because I caught him off the bottom. Oh, uh, foul hooked him, that's why. Has the old store opened yet? Uh, we, we are open um, soft, but tomorrow is our start of our grand opening. Oh, so sweet. all week, so tomorrow, Saturday, and Sunday. Okay, cool, cool. Uh, nine till nine. Where at Pensacola? Well, it's in Gulf Shores. Oh, Gulf Shores. Um, but it, it's uh, if you just if you just get on. Um, yeah, I follow you on Facebook. Okay, yeah, so. but yeah, if you just pull up, it's on Google Maps. You just type in Beach Bum Outdoors, it, okay, it'll cool. pull it up. So. Yeah, yeah I man. I wanted to go out to the rod room and pick up a new rod blank, so I was like, you know, whenever I do that, I'll find. Yeah, come on, man. Yeah, we'll be open from now on. So. Yeah. You're, you're all right. Oh, seriously? Yeah, I, I've had, I was just telling Brad uh, that happened to me the first time last year. I was on the jetties in Panama City and it was like this, stormy, and you know, electricity in the rod or whatever. It scares the crap out of you. I mean, we, we are just a huge lightning rod out here. I mean, good gracious. 
I mean, I saw lightning over there. I, I didn't hear the thunder though. Oh, it's definitely a freaking. Yeah, the quarter sail is storming like crazy. Yeah. Oh man. Yeah, that's gnarly. All right, switching back to the X-wrap here. We only got a few more minutes before we got to leave. First one to catch a king wins. <laughs> this is something I never thought I'd say before, but I'm about to the point where I need to put my hair up when it's this windy. Because <laughs> when I'm facing the other way, it's just all in my face. <laughs> I got you one. We look real cute with matching, <laughs> matching shirts and <laughs> two man buns. All right, last cast. <laughs> Oh! Oh! Are you kidding? Me? Are you kidding? <laughs> On the last cast. Panic, isn't it? I don't know. Dude. So got him? Yep. Yeah. It might be a king. No, it's freaking like a five pound spanner. Yeah, it might be a big spanner. Is what I thought it was. I'm good with either. Am I rolling? Uh, yes. Come on. On the last cast. I know that's hilarious, <laughs> dude. We're talking about getting out of here because it's a freaking storm. There's our dolphin. You are, you see him? Yeah, that's right here. Oh, snap. Where's your dick? Let's see if I get up. No. It got me. Oh, man. Dang it. Dang it. Dang it. Stupid dolphin. Coming back. He let go of him for a second. <laughs> you got him now. Ay, ay, ay. That was a nice fish. It was a very nice fish. Oh, here you go. Dang it. Too good Spanish? Either a big Spanish or a little king. Well, I just had either a big Spanish, like a giant Spanish. I, I think it was. Or a little king smoked the x wrap on the last cast. It's starting to rain a little bit. The storm's pushing in. Lightning. Yeah, we, we don't want to hang out here with lightning. There's a guy who, like, was feeling the lightning through his pole. Like, I don't, I don't really know exactly how that works. Yeah, well, he, you've had that I've before. Had it it's not lightning, it's just the whatever. Just all the electricity in the air. In the air was like going through his pulse he was like getting shocked so he left and uh we don't really want to fool around with that so we got about we got like a two hour drive back home we're gonna take these spanish over to the tackle store we got a ton of work to do because tomorrow is our grand opening and uh, we're gonna feed everybody that's helping us out so i'll catch y'all when we get there all right guys we made it to the tackle store and it's pouring down rain luckily we have this little cover over here I know, it's so convenient which i think leaks a little bit <laughs> it's a little wet out here but yeah. We have a ton of people inside working on getting the store ready for the grand opening tomorrow and hopefully it doesn't rain tomorrow. Thanks. We're praying. Yeah. <laughs> it's a big day, man. But we're about to cook everybody some of this Spanish. We're going to get everything ready to go, show you what you're working with, get to cooking. All right, I already got all the Spanish cleaned and bagged up and have it soaking in a little bit of milk. And I was trying to figure out what to batter it in and I found some Hooters wing seasoning. And who doesn't love Hooters, right? So we're gonna try Hooters on some Spanish. We're gonna transfer some of it into a clean bag here. It's like just, super loud out here, so hopefully you can hear me. I was just about to say, it's really loud. I hope they can hear you. Yeah. We'll figure it out. It's just the name. Yeah. Lines of Spanish. There, there were some pretty big Spanish. One of them was like huge. We got quite a bit of meat. And when I cleaned them, I went ahead and cut the bloodline all the way down, so I got two pieces, and then I cut those in half. So we got four pieces out of every Spanish. And I think we kept five. Open up this old Hooters seasoning batter, maybe. They don't make it easy. Since we got a bunch of fish, I'm just gonna go ahead and dump this whole bag in there. Let her rip. I'm excited to try the Hooters seasoning. Yeah. Should be good. Do you like Hooters wings? Never had them. You've never had Hooters wings? I can't say on camera. <laughs> <laughs> All 
I haven't been to Hooters in a long time. I don't even remember the last time I went to Hooters. Uh, we got the oil heated up to 350. I'm gonna go ahead and drop some fish in here. Probably not all gonna fit in one batch. Sizzling. There's lightning popping all around us. Glad we're covered. <laughs> First batch of fish ready to go. Looks pretty delicious. Good. Heck yeah. All we got is uh, some cardboard boxes and some paper towels, so we'll make do with that for a plate. I guess we got some barbecue in here too. Got a little assortment of everything. Pork, chicken, fish. You want to slide those? Where you want to go? Oh, nice. Almost a disaster. Look at that. Shoot. Nothing like some fried Spanish. You gonna go we with are, the bite? Yeah, we're, we're soft open. Have you had Spanish before? Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, that's good. You like it? Mm -hmm. We uh, we picked up some Hooters fried chicken batter. That's what we used. I haven't even tried it yet. But good. Delicious. Mm -hmm. Awesome. It's hot. Hot as hell. It, it just bubble. came off. No, no. So, yeah. Corey going with the bite. It might be a little warm. It just it, came out of the fryer. It but. seems just about perfect. Six five hundred. Six five hundred. Uh, you like it? It is really hot. <laughs> it's good fish. Fresh out the fryer. Yeah. <laughs> it's good. Y'all haven't met him. This is JJ. <laughs> First bite of fish they bought it at Kroger. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> That's delicious. You like it? Great job, guys. Heck yeah. There's plenty more where that came I'll from. I'll be back. All right, this is Mason, new employee. That's pretty you good like right there. You're going to take me out to catch some of these myself, We're going to do that. That's We're going to come see you from work one day. Okay. <laughs> Sounds good. Y'all know her. <laughs> She's going to go in for a bite. Oh, am I trying? Okay. Oh, unless you're not ready to no, eat some. No, I am. I was going to get Emily some good. chicken, but let's see. So, like, this piece down here is yeah, not too hot. So, all right. Oh, whoa. That's, that's a big fantastic. piece. Holy cow. Let's break it off of that. <laughs> Okay. Oh, it does feel so hot. It does feel still hot. It does you can still wait a minute. You can wait a minute. Get in and some food. You gonna go for it? Okay, I'll go for it. <laughs> Bring your tongue a little bit. Good <laughs> mm, though. Perfect. Oh, really good. I like it. So it's Spanish. Spanish mackerel. Spanish yep. mackerel. Yeah, it's really good. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Hey, bro. Watch out. That goes right. Yeah, I need my protein. I uh, I was busy. Um, we we had a customer come in. I saw. Yeah, we were we're right. selling. Very good. We risked our life today, basically. We did for our fish. We did. Uh, and hey, I will say this. Unfortunately, we and I haven't confirmed it. Brant sent a text. Yeah. We may need to confirm it, but right. we did hear. I have not confirmed. Unfortunately, I just want to bring this up. We heard that a fisherman unfortunately passed away from a lightning strike. Animal single here this morning. I want to bring it up. Take it seriously. Like serious thing. That's actually the number one killer on our beaches is lightning. So if there's lightning around a storm, please yeah. go inside. You know we we, we we probably stayed too long. We probably stayed longer than we should have. We but we did get out of there before the storm got in yeah. there. But take it seriously. I'm gonna be more cautious about that. Your family wants to come back home. Fishing's great. We love fishing. Not worth your life. Don't risk it. Hopefully, our prayers will be with his family or her family. I'm, I'm not even sure. I don't have all the details. Yeah, I, I, and, and you know we you know, we just heard it. I haven't confirmed it. Hopefully, it's not even true. Maybe it's just some hearsay. But uh, unfortunately, that's very sad news to hear. But take it very seriously. Go inside if you hear, if you hear thunder, lightning. Don't fish. Absolutely. All right, Nikki. <laughs> Time to go in for a bite. Hey, you found some, is that ketchup or you I found barbecue sauce? I'm just randomly picking up plates and eating oh, that, them. Okay, I don't, this wasn't even thing. mine. <laughs> but on all the videos, I'm either complaining and yelling at the guys about spending money or eating random fish that I've never had before. It's a tough job, somebody's gotta do it. It's probably pretty good with barbecue sauce. I, I like might have it. to try that. I'll taste it without. We found some uh, Hooters fit or chicken batter, <laughs> so, so we cooked it in Hooters. <laughs> you found what? <laughs> <laughs> I like it's it. It's just chicken batter. It's not fishy at all. It's not, no. Mm -mm. It's delicious. In Spanish, I've not actually had it in sushi yet, but Matt and Courtney usually eat it raw. Let's so do Spanish it. is supposed to be very good. I've so. had mackerel in sushi. Yep. But yeah, next time we catch some Spanish, we'll do some sushi. Let's do it over at my house. Absolutely. Sushi night. This is our one of our new employees, Don. I think y'all saw him trying to uh, spool some reels the other day. I tried to break it. <laughs> Going in with some Spanish mackerel. Oh yeah, nailed it, Brad. Absolutely. Perfect. Appreciate it, man. Nailed it. 
But guys, we're gonna finish getting set up for the grand opening this weekend. By the time this video is out, the grand opening will have already happened. So if we didn't meet, if you didn't come in, make sure you come down whenever you're on vacation. Come stop by the store, see us. Myself, Matt, and Brant will be here a lot, at least in the beginning, trying to get everything going. Um, so stop by, come see us. We have a ton of products. So next time you're down here in Gulf Shores, stop on by Beach Bum Outdoors. And you can also check us out online, beachbumoutdoors.com. Pick up anything you want. Uh, a lot of cool fish and tackle out there on the website. But appreciate it, guys. If you have not already subscribed to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. I'll catch y'all in the next one.